God is saying that may the love and grace of God surround your loved ones, and may they feel his presence in a real and tangible way. Thank God for blessing you with these special people, and trust in his perfect plan for their lives. In Jesus' name, Amen. Rejoice always, pray without ceasing, and give thanks in all circumstances, for this is the will of God for you. If you're ready, type yes. Dear Lord, today I thank you for the gift of life and for the privilege of a brand new month. I pray for abundance and blessings that we have not yet experienced. Remember, no problem is too big for God. In Jeremiah 17.14 it says, Heal me, O Lord, and I shall be healed. Save me, and I shall be saved, for you are my praise. God has been speaking to you about something, but fear has paralyzed you. Don't choose comfort over the incredible things that God wants to do in your life. Amen. God never said it would be easy, but he did promise to be with you. Whatever you are stressing about, put it in God's hands. He is the one who goes before you and will never leave you nor forsake you. God says he will make your crooked places straight and has already lined up the right people for you. Pray about everything, telling God your needs, and thanking him for all he has done. Cast your cares on the Lord, and he will sustain you. He will never let the righteous be shaken. Psalm 55, 22. Before the end of this month, something you prayed about will be set in motion. Don't worry for God will provide and take care of your troubles. Trust him. If you receive this, type Amen. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified for the Lord is with you, no matter what you are facing. The universe is saying to you today that whatever you have waited for, prayed for, stood for, and believed for is being released. Drop your Amen. Jesus gave thanks, and then the disciples distributed the bread, and it multiplied. God can use anything we surrender to Him. Praise Him. Publicly sharing God's word is both good and dangerous, as it comes with flattery, hate, temptation, pride, and impatience. Give praise to God alone for any good that comes out of it. This is not your platform. It belongs to God alone and his kingdom. God has something amazing in store for you, and you are so close. The best is yet to come. If you trust God, comment Amen. Remember, your words are powerful. Be extremely mindful of the words you speak into your life. The Bible says that death and life are in the power of the tongue. God is working everything out for your good and his glory. He will not fail you. If you agree, comment Amen. God is saying to you today that he will never send you into a situation alone. He will go before you, stand beside you, and walk behind you. If it hasn't happened yet, it doesn't mean it won't. The victory is on the other side of opposition but it takes staying power. Type yes if you believe in God.